in this video I'm going to be showing you the fastest way to rig your character. So over here I have a character. So first of all, to do this method, you're going to have to go into edit preferences and you're going to get a free add-on. It's free. Enable the rigify add-on. So you're going to type rigify and you just um, select the check mark. Once you have done that, what we're going to do now is we're going to add the bone. So go into front view. So select one numpad one. Shift A and inside armature, go into rigify metal rigs. You would want the human one. Do not go into basic and basic human. You can do that if you want, but I would just suggest you go into human. And then once you've done that, you're gonna scale up your armature to like it can to its scale so it can match the character. Now, once we have done that, we're gonna quickly hide our character. So press H to hide the character. We're gonna delete any unnecessary bones you do not want. For this purpose, I am I do not want to do any facial animation. So I'm gonna quickly just select this, go into edit mode, and delete every single facial bones. And then these ears as well, delete them. I do not want this, these bones, delete them as well. And then I don't want these bones as well. So I'm gonna delete these bones as well. That's it. So now once we have done that, I'm gonna do Alt Alt H to unhide it. So quickly go into object mode first, Alt H to unhide everything. And then over here, select the armature. And in the armature properties, we're going to go over here, mute port display, and select in front. And now we can see the bones when they're inside our mesh. Now, once we have done that, now we're going to go into front view. And now we're going to align our bones carefully inside our mesh. So we're going to select this and remember to go into edit mode, select these bones, and then rotate it. Before we even do that, actually, I think we should enable X axis mirror. So then we can actually mirror it on the other side. Then quickly grab this just like that. Like that. Then we're going to go into top view, select seven. And then rotate, grab, and quickly align it like you wish. And then for the hands, you can do it in more detail and take some time for the hands. So I'm going to quickly do them the hands. So I'm going to see in one second after I've aligned my fingers. So now I have carefully aligned the bones, the finger bones. Now we're going to do now we're going to do the legs. We're going to go into front view. Then we're just going to select these bones over here. So we're going to rotate it and then align it like that. That looks good. Now we're going to go into side view. Press numpad three. Then to align the bones just like that. I'm going to make this bone a bit small because of his um, muscles. His bone over there is a bit tiny, like. Once we have done that, now we're going to do. I'm going to delete this bone over here. I don't want these two foot bones. I'm going to want this bone over here. Side view. Select this. Grab it. Move it down, and then rotate it just like that. Grab it. Scale it down. As you can see, we have an extra bone over here in the meta rig. Sometimes the meta rig has some extra bones. I'm just going to delete this bone over here. You do not want this bone inside. This one over here. If it selects. There we go. X delete this bone over here. We do not want that. Now, once we have done that, it's aligned perfectly. It's not to be perfect. Once you've done that, you can take more, you can spend more time on it. Then once you've done that, select your character mesh, shift select your armature, control P, and then parent with automatic weights. Now, once you have done that, now if you go over here, select your armature, control tab to go into object mode. Or you can go over here, pose, I'm in pose mode, then you can rotate it. And as you can see, our character is fully rigged. That is a very easy way to rig your character. Super easy to rig. Literally, so easy. Now, if you like this, if you like the tutorial, do not forget to subscribe to my channel, watch other videos. If you want to know how to add inverse kinematics to this, you can also watch my videos. The link is gonna be in the description. And then if you want to manually know how to rig a character by extruding out your bones, I also have a video in the description below. So I'll see you guys in my next video.